Welcome back, Zero K fans, to another exhibition match. This is going to be One Cut versus Exist, and it's going to be on Zion, which is a very spider-friendly map. As we'll see, most likely they have yeah, One Cut in the south going for spiders, while Exist in the north going for cloaky bots, which is actually a little interesting. So yeah, like I said, very spider-friendly map, very hilly. It it just favors spiders. You just use spiders in this map. I mean. I can see Cloakies working, but they're going to have a lot of these little paths here that kind of have to work with. They can go around here. I mean, they can go up pretty much all these hills, but they are a lot slower. Although, you know what? Actually, these hills are all bot passable. There's a few small sections that aren't, but it looks like overall they are. A bit faster for Spider still. That being said, though, Cloakies have a lot of speed. So it will be very interesting to see how this works out. One cut first to get to Pro Exist base, and he will be able to find what is going on. He actually will be able to find this Conjurer pretty quickly. It looks like he'll be able to spot it, and then, at the same time, Exist not quite at One Cut's base. Once he gets there, he will find a Venom, and that Glaive will die, but that's what scouting is for. However, it looks like... It looks like Exist went for a bit of a heavy scout, getting a lot of Glaives, probably just... It looks like he's going for Glaives more for defense, trying to get rid of Fleas, make sure that One Cut does not have good vision of his base. While one cut on the other hand, how many fleas does he even have? He, oops, one cut does not have a whole lot. He actually doesn't see what's going on inside Exist's base at all. He only has a radar and a bit of line of sight of his own main base. Exist, on the other hand, is pretty much, he's all line of sight, but he does have the glaive up front. So he's able to scout a bit once he gets around to it, but he doesn't know exactly what's going on. And now there comes the, gla there comes the venom. And that glaive is not going to last very long at all. And there it down it goes. And it looks like Exist expanding a bit to the northwest. One Cut not expanding quite as much, so Exist is getting a quick economic advantage right off the bat. One Cut quickly getting red back, looks like to go for red back Venom. And just try to push forward, getting through the Glaives, while Exist building the Glaives to be pushed through by the red back and Venom. So right now, One Cut's main disadvantage is economy. Looks like he's not even going for economy too heavily. Is he, is he building any workers? He has a Weaver up here. He is going for the north, sorry, the southeast. His commander is also is building radar, but doesn't look like he's building much else at this point. So we don't know what he's up to. While Exist, on the other hand, he is building up economy with workers, with a bunch of conjurers around the map. A couple conjurers to the, to the northwest. Nothing in the northeast yet, but he will likely go for that pretty soon. And his glaives are all just getting to the center of the map to be used. Looks like a direct push in. Gonna have to contend with that venom though, and then the red back right behind it, and more venoms once a, that is through. Venom, by the way, does have splash damage. Unlike the last game, Zeus actually doesn't have splash damage. Just deals a lot of damage. Venom does have splash. It's going to be able to tear... Well, it's going to be able to stop all these glaives, and then the red back can tear them apart with at leisure. It's going to be very much a matter of micromanagement, and it's going to be difficult. Exist is going to have to spread out his glaives pretty much in a massive circle around here, and then go in from all angles to make sure the Venom does not stun all of them at once. And even that's going to be tough against that red back, so it looks like Exist is retreating, trying to get as many glaives as he can together, Still going pure no, getting Zeus actually. Not going pure glaive, he will be getting some Zeus's once this conjurer is done. And getting some defenders as well, retreating back to his defenses while one cut continues to build more redbacks, weavers, and venoms. But it looks like we do have all well, these glaives just getting ready. They are not quite going in yet, but they are getting ready. And in comes one cut, he is going for an attack now. He is going to see that Defender a lot more being built up behind it, so Pro Exist wants to make sure he does not have any openings in the west side of his base. The east side of his base is very open. That's actually the way that one could, could very easily deal with this. The west side of the base, however, is not. Exist, however, does have... Oops, he does have radar coverage of the north side of the map. Actually, the north half of the map and a little bit more. He is well aware of what one cut's going to be doing. He's well aware if one cut goes along the east side of the map too, and it looks like he's actually about to build up there with this... Yeah, this one conjurer is going over to the east side of the map. That will build up nicely. And one cut is not taking advantage of being a spider, while Exist is taking advantage of what the spider should be going along the top cliff. Going on this high cliff and the west side of the map, while one cut at the lower section. For some reason, staying in the valley with the spiders, not the best strategy. Spiders really do de depend on terrain and ambushing. Which in this map is something they have, but at the same time, something that Cloakies can take away from them. And it looks like more, well, 
the Redbacks and Venom's Ruby done, going and switching to Recluse production, while Exist is no longer producing anything. He's decided. Oh, never mind. There's the Glaives. Didn't let me finish my sentence. Well, whatever. Exist, however, is going to have to deal with this. He, his uh, commander getting hit by some Venoms, but that Redback goes down quickly. The commander's going to get. No! Doesn't go down quickly. In fact, thanks to the Venoms, that Redback able to get close enough and. Commander gets stunned out, but not completely. The Venom. Venom did not live long enough, that Redback did not live long enough. Exist Commander just barely survives, and a bunch of fleas over the east side of the map. One Cut knows what's going on, knows that he has at least a bit more room to attack in the east side of the map, but not by much. And having just lost basically his army at this point, it's not going to work out too well. The One Cut switching over to pretty much pure Recluse production. He's kind of have a hard time actually hitting anything, honestly. Recluses have a bit of a hard time with hitting. They might have been tweaked recently. I know some of the units were tweaked when it came to how they tried to lead their shots. Recluses might be one of them, and if so, their accuracy is probably improved. Because, honestly, it couldn't get any worse. <laughs> but One Cut, building up a defender in a valley. Once again, not entirely sure why. It's something I've noticed about One Cut. He has been playing a lot in the valleys. I'm not sure why he's doing that. It's an odd place with defenders. You want them on the hills, you want them to have the range advantage, or at least you want them to have no obstacles in the way. But it doesn't matter though, Exist coming in from the east side of the map with a bunch of glaives. He is dealing with everything in the east side of the map, everything that one guy had set up. Getting rid of a Weaver, getting rid of some of the medley extractors, and Recluse is... Actually, looks like Recluse is not trying to lead the shots. Okay. And as you can see, it actually is able to hit sometimes. Against moving targets. In a hilly area. I guess it's been improved. So yeah, Recluse got a slight buff. However, Exist just able to get around the map, deal with everything. He is actually able to deal with this east, southeast side as well. One Cut has very few options at this point. Playing spiders is always a bit of a tricky thing to do. And even on this map, even though it is kind of a spider map, it's not enough. Or at least the way it was being played out is just not enough. Venoms would help, but Reckless against Glaives is not going to work out. In general, Raider beats Skirmisher. Spider Cloaky matchup is no exception. Except that in Cloaky matchup, Glaive beats most everything, and Rocco beats everything else, which surprisingly enough, we haven't seen any. But I guess Exist is confident enough in his Glaive micro, and there haven't been enough Venoms to really justify getting anything else. Especially against Recluses, it's really the best option as Glaives. Still, one clap upgrading his commander once again, while Exist is just taking the north side. Exist is taking the north side. Exist has double the economy of one cut. One Cut basically has one shot, effectively, to come in, try to harass everything out. Exist Commander, Beam Laser, and fully healed up after the last attack, by the way. Had no problems there, so Exist Commander is just... He has taken over. He's in the front lines. Bit of a risky thing to do with the Recluses going around, but the Recluses are firing uphill, and that does not help them hit anything. Except maybe by chance, way in the back. So, some harassment coming in from One Cut, but that's not going to be enough. At the same time... Exist goes for a full-on assault from the southwest side of the map with a few Zeus's. At the same time that those recluses are trying to raid from the front. But that's not going to do it. One Cut's commander on the front line as well. And it won't even be able to help. It doesn't actually have a weapon. It has armor. Extra health. That's about it. And it's not even close enough to help out. Radar being built on the hill, but One Cut, unfortunately, a little bit late with that. And the Zeus's at the southwest side of the map are about ready to just deal with everything. Looks like the Redback would have had a chance if his Venom was around, but not so much. Able to make the Zeus stop so the Reckless can hit at any rate, but still. Even with all that, Exist pushes one cut back into his base and pretty much is going for the kill. This is going to be it. This is the last fight. If these Zeus's go down, then one cut may have a bit of a chance, but a very small chance at that. There's just really no way this is going to likely happen. One more Zeus does go down, however, and Redback still up, still unstunned. Actually dealing quite a bit of damage here on top of the laser tower, but... Wow, actually able to get rid of the Zeus. Well, how about that? Exist moving his commander up front. Possibly a bad idea, but we'll see Beam Laser with speed and armor, but or speed and health. But even with that, one guy has to retreat his commander, about to lose it, but able to get it out of the way. Speed and armor for him, but still, one cut is just has been behind this entire game. Really has. He has actually more money invested in his army. But a lot of that is recluses, and what isn't is Venoms and Redbacks, which, not ineffective, but still, the point is he hasn't, doesn't have map control. I mean, yeah, he has a, an army advantage at the moment, but Exist can just rebuild everything. A lot of that was Exist lost three Zeus's. 
Well, he can rebuild those Zeus's pretty much... Got a couple caretakers up, he can build rebuild them within a minute. Easily. So, I mean, immediately a minute is a pretty long time in 0k, but... That's not saying much. Exist has the map, he has most of the game. One Cut is now getting some reclaim. He is actually pushing these caretakers forward to... Well, forward, but he's pushing these caretakers to help build up, use up the reclaim, but even then... Doesn't really have enough reclaim to make it work. One, his commander's up front, though. He could actually reclaim all this. And Weaver up front as well, surprisingly enough, not reclaiming all of this. However, a lot of harassment is coming in. One Cut should probably move his commander... He needs to move his commander back so it doesn't die. Reclaiming the Zeus's would be a good idea. 140 metal, by the way, that's how much they were worth. Yeah, 140 metal, very good thing to have, but he's not doing that. He needs to reclaim this, that's all he's got, is to try to get his army to still outnumber exists, if nothing else. I mean, he is actually managing to take a side pretty decisively, but the problem is that he's consolidating in a, in a losing position, as I've said before. That's not something you want to do. And, yeah, it's like 15 seconds per Zeus, or should be, anyway. Saying two minutes. I guess Exist is just building too much on the front lines for that to work out. So never mind. One cut actually has a chance because of the fact that Exist is building up all these defenders up front. If his commander goes down, though, he is going to have to deal with a lot of Zeus's. But before that happens, it's going to be... It is going to be a bit of a problem. I mean... Exist is getting pushed back slightly. Not much, but slightly. Venom coming in, stunning out a Lotus, and a Redback coming to help support. Lotus is fully stunlocked, by the way. Exist commander, unfortunately, on the high ground to these Recklesses. The Recklesses went to slightly higher ground, a bit more of an even attack. If they went to this hill here, they'd have, I think, a chance. No, they don't have the range, never mind. They have to go up around the side. Kind of tricky to do, but still able to push back somewhat. Venoms and Redbacks are dealing a decent amount of damage, and One Cut just needs to reclaim. That's all he needs to do, is get some reclaim. If he reclaims all these Zeus, I mean, there's so much reclaim here. There's got to be at least... 500 metal worth of reclaim. That's... Okay, actually not all that much. It's like two or three venoms. But still, it's probably more than that. I'm probably way underselling it. Yeah, it's... He's got to reclaim this. Because that just gets in the income he needs to make the, all those caretakers useful. Still, he does... Like, this is what I mean. Exist now, his army has evened out. Because of the economic advantage. His army has evened out. He hasn't been building anything. He has been able to build more units as a result. However, one cut getting over this hill... At least with his frontline units, not with the recluses, but the frontline units are over that hill. But Exist switching over to gunships, how did I miss this? Exist has switched over to gunships, he switched over a while ago. And the Banshees are going to be able to die horribly. Because they can be hit from the ground. Because gunships can be hit pretty effectively from the ground overall, all things considered. So, even without Tarantulas, Exist, he's able to push this back somewhat. But not as much as I'm sure he would have liked. That being said, One Cut is losing a lot of his army, but so is Exist. More Banshees are coming in, but they are pretty much dying at about the same rate. However, existing One Cut's commanders are getting into a duel, but One Cut does have all the Recklesses as support, and Exist's commander is about to be stunlocked out by this Venom. Well, the second Venom. More Venoms coming in, and Recklesses are over the hill once again, able to get accurate shots off, and Exist's commander is one shot away from dying. This Redback gets close enough, it goes down, Exist loses his commander. That is a major frontline blow. And Exist actually taking quite a bit of damage here. The gunship plant has gone cold, and the Roccos are being pumped out. This is what Exist needed to do a while ago. Pump out the Roccos. That pretty much counters the Spider Factory. Not sure if One Cut is going to switch his factory as a result of this. He, I don't think he's aware of this yet. However, Banshees are going around the side, and no Tarantulas... Oh, no, two Tarantulas are being built as a response. Somewhat expansive response, but it will work out. Actually, one of them is already in play, and another one's being built up. Just finished up. It will be able to get rid of these Banshees, no problem. However, like I said, Redbacks and Venoms also do the trick. But hey, at least one cut has stabilized somewhat. You still should get rid of the east side of the map, try to reclaim that, take the entire south half. But at least he pushed Exist back, got rid of his commander, and in fact, he's in a decent position to start reclaiming that commander. Would be a good idea to do too. One cut's commander right there, actually level 3 commander too. Not a whole lot for level 3 commander, mostly just for health and I guess... For health, that's really about it. If he's playing support comm, I could see for build power. I don't think recon comm gets speed as part of his upgrade, so he doesn't have a lot of modules here. That's the one thing. But Exist has gotten attention drawn to his Roccos. They are, they weren't really provoked, but they are attacking. The Venom, unfortunately, not going to work out. This is exactly what the Roccos counters the Venom. And one cut, 
cannot take this reclaim. Exist takes it instead and will be able to use it quite effectively. However, one cut is still reclaiming. He is still taking some reclaim on the southwest side, I think. Well, it took some of the Banshees. Yeah, reclaiming some of the Banshees and Medlic Tractors that were lost. But not really reclaiming much in the way of meaningful stuff. And his commander over the side here. Still no special... Oh, he has Beam Laser. Never mind. He does have the Beam Laser. That is somewhat useful, but still... Rocco's Counter Spiders. Rocco's just outright Counter Spiders. There's Recklesses can help, especially in these large numbers. In numbers, Recklesses can counter Rocco's. But it's like the range advantage is pretty substantial, actually. Like, 80 range difference. So that's that's a big difference. But it really comes down to numbers, because enough Recklesses will be able to just saturate an area with rockets, get rid of the Rocco's. But Exist has pushed one cut back, able to reclaim his commander, and that's a lot of metal, too, because that was a level 2 commander. So getting that reclaim is very important for Exist. That'll get him back in the game. At this point, one cut has a massive army advantage, but... Black Dawn up. That's actually most of Exist's army right now is Black Dawn's. The rest is Rocco's. One cut, however, he's got a lot in Recklesses. Because the thing is, with Spider, it's difficult to really showcase how much army they have when it comes to this number. As you can see, all the Spider units other than Fleas are really quite expensive. Like Fleas are 20 metal each, and everything else is in excess of 200 metal, except Hermits are 160. So, 6,000 metal, that... That is actually mostly the commander, most likely. Like, half of that's going to be the commander. And the rest of that could easily be the Recklesses. Or, well, let's see, there's... Recklesses being 300 each, there's 1,500 in Recklesses. And the rest of it, I guess, is the Tarantulas and Redbacks and stuff that's sort of just dotted around the map. That is going to be... Basically, an overrating of One Cut's armies. Right now, Exist has an advantage. Still has an advantage in economy, still has an advantage in territory. He has the Rockers, which are being countered by the Recluses. The one thing, he doesn't have any Glaives coming in to deal with the Recluses directly. Still pushing heavy Rocco, so One Cut does have a chance as a result of this. Because One Cut is getting more and more Recluses. He's pushing out, and getting some Venoms as well, but pushing out a lot of Recluses. Wait. Never mind, he only has four Recluses, but he does have the Redbacks as well. That's not going to help out much. Four Recluses, that's actually apparently just enough, though. Still able to deal with a lot of these Roccos. But that being said, Exist is just pushing one cut back, and here come the Black Dons. The majority of Exist... That's his military expenditure right there, but still, that's going to get rid of the commander right now. He's going to jump one cut. If he's paying attention, we'll be able to jump right on time. It's a tough timing, though, and he's not going to do it. No, losing his commander instead, and one cut just decides he is too tired to play and throws in the towel. A bit of an anticlimactic ending. I... sorry about that. But still, a very interesting game nonetheless. Showing spiders and cloakies, although I think I think one cut had more of a chance. He just needed to scout a bit more, seeing where the weak spots were. That's the thing with spiders. You need to know where your opponent's weak spots are, you need to know where your opponent is going and where to ambush them. I mean it's a bit less so because of the way the red backs and the recluse buff, but still, you have to be paying a lot of attention to what your opponent is doing if you're playing spiders. It's just a big part of the matchup. And I think that's gonna be it for me tonight. I didn't really find any other replays, and it's kinda hard to tell the New engine, while interesting, kind of cool. It's good to have the new engine. Has apparently had some issues with crashing. So, I don't know how many games that have been played are actually stable. Anyway, if you guys, obviously, as usual, just let me know if there are games that you think are cool to watch, that are good games to cast. And I'll be doing 0k again Saturday. Because I'll probably be doing Acron on Thursday. So, thank you all for watching, and that will be it for me tonight. So, have a good night, everyone.